Yeah, what's up everyone? I'm back with another video today. Um, and I'm doing a Beyblade video today. I'm going to be doing a tutorial. I'm going to be doing some tutorial videos today. On how to do yo-yos. Now I'm going to teach you the basics on how, uh, how to put the yo-yo on. How to throw it. And some tricks I'm going to do. Because I've played with yo-yos now. Um, since uh, I think since high school, can't remember when I started. I think I started around um, uh, tenth grade. I think I think I started around tenth grade. All right, so let's get into the tutorial. Okay, now the way you put the yo-yo, the way you get the yo-yo on your uh, finger, you gotta put it through this loop right here. As you can see, there's a loop right here. This little hole right here, you pull part of the string up, okay, and then, and then you pull the string through the hole, and that's how you put. Then you put it on your middle finger, which it or whichever hand you are. I'm left-handed, so I yo-yo with my left hand. And voila, that's how you put your yo-yo on. That's how you put the yo-yo on your finger. Now I'm gonna teach you how to um, actually throw it, okay? So here we go. Let's... Okay. The way you do this, hold the yo-yo like this, or you hold it like this with two fingers, but this is a big yo-yo, so I gotta use three fingers right here. You hold it like this, put your wrist up like this, put your arm back, then you throw. And right there is a sleeper. You can throw it as hard as you can, but not too hard. You make sure, make sure you don't throw it. Throw your arm down too far, or or it will hit the ground. Now the way to bind uh, this yo-yo, um, some yo-yos can bind them. Some yo-yos are are responsive. With the flick of the wrist, uh, you just flick it up and it'll come back up to you. But this one is not responsive. So, the way you do this with an unresponsive yo yo, pull the string up like this, like you're gonna do the elevator. Pull it like this. Put it over the yo yo like this, and then you pull up real fast. Sometimes the yo yo doesn't run, spawn with me. Okay. Hang on, I'm a little tangled up right now. Darn it. Well. Well, that's a problem. And make sure that, um,. Make sure you don't get your uh, string all tangled up because this is what happens when you get it tangled up. Hang on, let me put the light on. Yeah, that's better. Make sure you don't get your string all tangled up like this because this is what happens. If you uh, pull it too tight, that will leave it in that same knot and you can't get it out. And then next thing you know, you'll have to buy a new string. Hang on, my little, my strength's being a little um, finicky right here. Let's see. I'm not really good at it. Usually my mom does this for me because I'm not really good at this. Alright. I'm to wrap the yo yo up, but I shan't. You put your 
thumb right here and wrap it around. Once you wrap, once it's tight enough, you let go of it, you let go of the thumb right there. Voila, your yo yo is ready again. Now the first trick that I just did with the, the first trick I just did with the sleeper. Okay. Now the next trick is a really easy trick. Next trick's real easy. The bind. This. Okay. Bind like this. I did show you this, but I didn't show you when the yo is being fat. Bind like this. Do like this, and then you flick your wrist up. See that again. Voila. I thought the yo doesn't want it. My string is a little tangled up now. That's how you do the bind. Okay. Next up is Rock the Baby. Pull the string up. You uh, put your fingers like this. You hold it like this. Or you can hold it like this. They start, and then you swing the yo yo back and forth. That's Rock the Baby. Except I do, do it a little differently. That's sideways. I do it like this. And you can do crazy rock the baby by uh, flicking the yo-yo forward really fast. That was too fast for me. I'll do it again. Okay, swing the baby like this. Then you flick it. Get a better angle like this. Right here. Swing the yo back and forth, and then, then you uh, flick it all the way around. Flick it all the way around, real fast. That's how you do rock the baby. Crazy rock the baby. But I can't do crazy rock the baby with this because I'm afraid to hit myself. Up next is Eiffel Tower. Take your hand like this with a high five. Pull it back. Pull the string back like this. Two fingers. Grab the string right here. Pull. And voila. There's Eiffel Tower. Let's see, let's do that again. Pull the string. If you want to make the Eiffel Tower big or small, you gotta pull the string up. You gotta pull the string down for the other to come up to make a bigger one, or you loosen it to make it smaller. Me, I do a little bigger. And voila! There is Eiffel Tower. That's the Eiffel Tower. Now, now we're gonna do rock the baby. With, now we're gonna do rock the baby through the Eiffel Tower. Do the same thing like you did before, like the Eiffel Tower, but instead, of holding it like this, I'm gonna pull it down like this. Make a nice big gap. Then you rock. Then you rock the baby. Rock the baby through the Eiffel Tower.
Let's do that again, but a lot faster this time. the pause the video for for a minute okay all right sorry about that guys um all right why are okay, where are you oh yes i was gonna do oh, gonna, i did rock the baby through the eiffel tower okay next up it's the flying trapeze now this i can't deal with this yo-yo but the way you uh, throw the yo-yo you hold it like this and then and then you just flick it and then you flick it that way whichever way you throw it if you're right hand, you throw it to the left. If you're left hand, you throw it to the right. And me, I do a little differently with this, yeah. I, I do the, I do the forward pass. Now, if you don't know what the forward pass is, you hold it like this, swing your arm back, and then forward pass. And then you flick it back. To, you flick it back for the yo to come back to you. Now with the flying trap bees, you gotta make sure the yoda lands on the string. Now watch this. Ah. Alright. Here is how you put the yoda on the string. You gotta put one finger on it. Then you put both of your fingers on. There you go. And flying trapeze. That was the man on the flying trapeze. Now, D and that, now, the way you uh, do the flying saucer, you gotta throw it sideways. done this trick for a while and it's gonna be a little hard for me to do. And as you see it it is it is a little tricky to do but this is the way I do it. sideways. Then you make the string spin around and then you gotta flick it up to make it come back but I'm, but like I said before this you know, it's not responsive like that. Okay. Man I man, I'm not awake. Okay. Um, next track, um, I can't remember the name of it, but I think it's called the, oh, I can't, I can't remember the name, but it's a really cool trick. Okay, throw the yo-yo down, put your finger up, string over, and then swing the yo-yo. Around and around and around and around and around. Get the yo-yo back up. Brain twister. That's what it's called. It's called the brain twister. Okay. So, what do you do to brain twister? And now let me get in the right position for y'all. 
có không ơi yeah. Hold the yo-yo up String underneath the yo-yo Make sure your fingers are together And you do the brain twister You can do it as much you can do it as long as you want to make just make sure that you watch it yell yo cut it will slow down a lot. Okay. Then next next up it's one hand star. Okay. To do one hand star, put your thumb up. Use your ring finger, do it like this, point your finger, go up, then pinky, then voila, one hand stop. Now, do it a little faster than that time. Okay. Okay, my one hand star is not really that good, but But yeah, that was one hand star. <sighs> and I gotta quit yawning. Here's another thing. Okay. Now we're gonna get to the string. Here's one there's one thing you should not do when you're playing with yo yo. Do not do not bind the yo yo when the strings like this. Make sure you pull it out. Hold the yo yo up. Just let the string unwind itself. If it's not fully unwind, just slide your finger down. And then, there you go. And that, that's how you unwind the string if it gets tangled up like that. Alright. Uh, Alright, so that would be my uh, tutorial and. So now we're going to tutorial you on the yo-yo and the tricks you can do with it. I hope you um, hope you all like the video. I hope you all like the video. Don't don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to uh, leave a comment down below to see which to, to see which tutorial you want to see me you want me to do next. You want me to do yo-yo tutorial again, or do you want me to do baby tutorial, or hot wheels tutorial, or even soccer or basketball? All right, all right. See you guys in the next video. Peace.